Getting started with the circuit mono station. In the box. In the mono station box, you'll find the unit itself, the getting started guide, three MIDI cables, a USB cable, and the power supply. Registration. On the back of the booklet, you'll find the bundle code and serial number. The serial number can also be found on the box. You'll need to go to www.novationmusic.com forward slash register and click register your product. Select the circuit mono station from the products, like so, then enter your serial number. Now enter your email. If you already have an account with Novation, you'll be asked to log in. If you don't have an account, you can create one now. Now enter the bundle code and the rest of the information on the page, like so. You'll now see the circuit mono station within your account. If you click the downloads and activation tab, you can find the guides and bundled software such as Ableton Live Lite. You can download this here, and the code is also shown here. Connection. On the rear of the unit, you'll see the USB and power supply. There's also a MIDI in, out, and through port, along with other connections like clock and note out. You'll find an audio input and the mono line output. To start recording the mono station in the door, you'll need to take the line output into a line input on your interface. Open your door of choice and select an audio channel and record enable the track. And then set the correct input, in this case input one. Turn up the master volume on the mono station. You can also record and playback MIDI signals from your door. In Ableton, go to live, preferences, click the MIDI tab and turn the MIDI ports on for the mono station like so. You should now be set up and ready to use the mono station.